looking at. Are you okay? Yeah. <laughs> so windy. Um. <laughs> Go ready. Sound speed. Try latte scene four shot three take one. So, our film is about a boy called Sam who is a trans man and he's reconciling with his family after a, a previous experience has gone wrong. And it's a film that shows how that connection can be remade through Sam and his experience with his mother. We wanted to make this film to kind of like put a spin on a lot of LGBT films. They often tend to end in heartbreak and stuff and we wanted to bring a message of like hope and that healing is possible. We had to move location because the original house that we were filming at, which was my uncle's house, um, my uncle had been hospitalised so we had to move to my house. Um, and we had to adapt quickly to a lot of changes. The house that we filmed in has a very different layout, so a lot of the camera angles we had originally planned kind of had to be changed. And I think I had to push through a lot of personal anxieties too while that was all happening. When we lost the first location, I was very, I was like almost convinced that um, we wouldn't have a film. Charlie just powered on and kept doing it. And through that, we all did our best to support Charlie. And in the end, we um, ended up finishing the film. I kind of took on the job of trying to make sure we were on schedule, making sure all the crew were um, dealing with their jobs and making sure that if they had any problems, it would be resolved so the director didn't have to get involved. It was really like fun watching this film kind of, I had a vision for like watching it come to life. I found it really difficult to not have my hands on the camera personally and I guided Will the best I could but I think from this production I have learned that I'd much rather be like a camera operator or a director of photography than maybe just full on director. I found working on this film uh, difficult and stressful but I think that um, we all worked together and made it work and I'm very proud of us as a crew for achieving what we set out to do. As long as you've got the right crew, if you work together, you can come up with solutions to try and fix the problems that come up. I also learned from everyone else during this film that teamwork is absolutely essential. Some of the things that we achieved with this film wouldn't have been possible without the amazing work that everyone put in. And some people came up with some brilliant ideas that me and Corey never would have come up with on our own. During this project I also learned I'm a lot more resilient than I previously thought I was and I surprised myself by being able to push through and keep going and get it all done. Another thing I learned from my own experience was that um, I was capable of leading um, as when Charlie was dealing with actors or needed a second to think about what was going on I would take charge of the crew and make sure the crew were on doing their roles and if anyone needed any help with anything, I would always be there to try and provide that support. It taught me that I may have like an ability to lead, um, which would be interesting to see how that plays out next year. Overall, during this production, I learned that not rushing and not panicking through and making sure you actually take a moment to process is also really essential. So in future productions, I know that even if problems do arise and things do go wrong, it's important to just take a moment, process it all, and then see how we can move on after that rather than just rushing and panicking through all the projects. This film means a lot to me as a trans person, and I hope it will mean a lot to other people as well. And I hope people can understand that forgiveness and healing is possible.